Hello, welcome to Kent Beer Reviews. Right, I've got another beer from the Siren Craft Brew. Um, I've done the original of this last year. Check it out on the playlist of Siren Craft Brew. This is their barrel aged Caribbean chocolate cake um, in collaboration with Cigar City out in Florida. It's coming in at 8.4% ABV. Um, it's in a 330 ml bottle. I've had this probably about a month or so, two months. Um, it's a luxurious stout with Cigar City Brewing, has now been aged in bourbon barrels for 12 months. Um, expect all the glorious deep chocolate and rich roast notes of the original, which it was amazing, um, with the, with an added complexity of whiskey, vanilla and enhanced wood characteristics, pure bottle, bottled indulgence. So there's their bottle cap, let's crack this open, it's been out of the fridge for probably about two hours or so. There's a little bit of smoke but not much. Oh, try and generate a little bit of a, a tan coloured head. It certainly is. It's a finger and a half of, yeah, medium tan coloured head. Nice kind of coffee kind of coloured head to it. Into the light then, pitch black as you'd expect. Really nice looking beer in the glass, really nice. It's getting aroma. Big, uh, dark baker's chocolate. Again, a little bit of booziness. There's more, yes, yeah, that kind of creamy chocolate. Just lovely. There's that bourbon there. Hmm. Let's give it a try. Cheers. Big bourbon notes in this beer, for sure. Big bourbon. Very sweet. Very sweet. Let's go again. Dark fruits, maybe some dates. Find a strong dark fruit, smooth mouthfeel. Yeah, there is that kind of. I don't so to say if it's with. Um, uh, doesn't. Oh, here we go. Yeah, lactose. That's what I was thinking. Uh, water, malted barley, hops, yeast, uh, cypress wood, lactose, and cocoa nibs. So certainly that the lactose is giving that real kind of sweet edge. The cocoa nibs are coming through. Um, that kind of the barrel aging. You're picking up a little bit of sweet, maybe some vanilla from the the bourbon barrels. Very easy drinking. I mean, it's uh, it's at room temperature, as I've said, eight point four percent. Pull the rest of this in then. I was lucky to get my hands on this. I think I thought I'd missed it. I left it for quite a while after when it was released, and then it was still around. So I found out, and I've got a couple of bottles. Yeah, I... right. Let's go for it then. Right. The there's something missing for me for this. It's still very very nice. I'm comparing it to the original, which was last year, and I thought that beer was absolutely amazing. I can't remember it, but I thought it was absolutely to die for. This, on the other hand, I'm not having that kind of the same kind of wow factor that you know the original gave me although it's still very very good um it says yeah it's tropical stout aged in bourbon barrel so i'm, I'm guessing it could be first or second well, it's, it's probably not first maybe second run bourbon barrels i don't know if you know put it down below It'd be nice to find out 
<coughs> excuse me. But yeah, it's still a very, very nice beer. Um, as for rating, I'm going to give it an 8 out of 10. Um, I think I gave the original a 10 out of 10. Um, I'm starting to get a little bit more used to these beers now, so it's kind of, I don't know where I'm, where it's me or my palate's changed or, or what. Um, but I just feel that this has been slightly taken away. It's still an A beer. It's still probably a 93 out of 100. So it's still a very good beer. If you can get hold of it and you like your bourbon chocolatey stouts, this is really, very really nice. Um, I just prefer the original, personally. Nothing wrong with it, it's just me, you know. Anyway, um, I don't know anyone else who's had this beer who I watch regularly on YouTube. So if I do, I'll, I'll put the link down below, along with the uh, playlist for Siren Craft Brew. Cheers for watching then, and I'll see you on the next review. Cheers.